Kentucky has announced that they're going to have – how about this? Mark Stoops said that there will be multiple players that are out for multiple games with suspensions. He has not referenced anybody specifically. Uh, we've been talking all offseason about Chris Rodriguez, et cetera. There's been rumors galore. We talked about him some. If you want to go back through the YouTube feed and search for it, then then you're more than welcome to. Uh, but this is – let's go on and pull this up uh, so that you can hear what Mark Stoop said here. Uh, this just cracked me up. Absolutely cracked me up. I have to be very conscientious of that. Um, I expect um, – a few of them that have multiple game suspensions, but I, I, don't, I don't know. I really, you know, I'll, I'll address it next week. Uh, I expect maybe uh, one of them to be back next, you know, next week, but we'll, we'll see how that goes. Did you clarify which players are suspended and which ones aren't on there? The I didn't say suspended. You did. Uh, they're, they're unavailable to play. Well, and I have. What? <laughs> I didn't say suspended. You did. He said. I expect a few of them to have multiple game suspensions. Can you tell us which players are suspended? I didn't say suspended. You did. They are unavailable to play. Like, what is he talking about? Uh, and yes, I would still, like if I'm Nebraska, I would still want him to be my head coach because obviously the man knows what he's doing. Uh, but this is pretty interesting stuff with Florida on deck next week. Now, obviously, you've got Miami of Ohio in week one. Ought to be able to get through that, no problem. Next week, going down to the swamp, and I understand it's Billy Napier's first year, and you're still trying to figure things out for you know if you're Florida, etc. Uh, you got Florida coming off of a game against Utah, but who? I if I'm Kentucky, I want all hands on deck for that game in Gainesville. It is not an easy place to win, no matter what the situation is down there. I, I mean, it was years and years until Kentucky was able to get a win in Gainesville. So this is something to pay attention to, and I haven't found any news about it. But I'm I'm curious if there's any Kentucky fans in the in the feed, like toss this thing in. Let us know what is going on here, because I haven't heard other than rumors. I haven't heard anything official. I don't know who is out, etc. Who should we be looking at as being out for this game and possibly the next game? And then after that, I mean, I think week three, they play another cupcake, et cetera. So we'll, we'll get to there when we get there. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter, at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.